Everyone is used to seeing the odd house spider from time to time, but when my husband told me to come quick and check out the black widow spider in my garage, what? Here in the Okanagan Valley of BC, we have these venomous spiders, I thought? I had to find out for myself. I decided to post my video that you are looking at here to see if someone could verify if it was indeed a black widow. The responses came in and many just responded with, yikes, or that's creepy. Adam thought it looked like one. Even my storm chase partner, Mark Robinson, who has a wildlife biology degree said, yep, female black widow. The perfect black widow looks shiny black, relatively large, so one and a half inches long from leg to leg. And they have a red shiny um, hourglass sign on their belly. And usually black widows build a web and they're in their web belly up showing off their beautiful hourglass. I had heard that they were around here in the Okanagan Valley, but they're actually in many locations right across the country. We have them in Ontario, they're just pushing northwards into Quebec, and we have them in BC, and they're just making about, about the Rocky Mountains into Alberta, and we have them a lot in the Okanagan uh, specifically. They like it very hot, which we have in the Okanagan, but they also like it humid. So what I learned is they really just get a bad rap and it's kind of unfounded. It's the only spider in Canada that can harm us to the point that we should go to the hospital and seek medical attention. But they don't like to bite. They're very, very timid. Black widows have very, very short fangs, and it's very unlikely that they're able to bite through your skin. So even if you get bit, 50% of the reported black widow bites, nothing happens, like absolutely nothing. If you, however, feel symptoms, 47% of the reported black like, widow bites, it feels like a strong bee sting. Localized swelling, localized muscle cramps, redness, and nothing more. So I would still recommend stay calm. 3% is when the venom spreads in your body and you get more central effects of body-wide muscle cramps. And that is where the reputation comes from. Death is very unlikely based on a black widow bite, but I would definitely recommend that you, again, stay calm and then seek medical attention. So if you're lucky enough to see one of these black beauties, instead of squishing her with your shoe, maybe just walk on by and let her show off her perfect hourglass markings to the world around her. For the Weather Network, I'm meteorologist Jacqueline Whittle.